Wow. Oh. All right, it's time for a little adventure in the desert. And I think this is the trail here. <laughs> Lead the way, Zach. Yeah, this, there it is. Like this <laughs> we are outside of Las Vegas, near the cowboy trails. But this is a new addition. We're gonna ride up Flow Job and uh oh, <laughs> cacti. We're gonna ride up Flow Job and then down Ebb and Flow. Joshua trees. Usually just see them from the side of the road, yeah. really far away. And then when I'm up close now, I'm like doubting myself. Yeah, and they're probably like 50 years old to be this little tiny thing. It's actually pretty nice out. It's chilly here in the desert, but not much wind. So I feel like I'm gonna get pretty warm pretty quick, but this is good. Whew. <laughs> I see a, I think this is the trail we're gonna come back down when we finish. Let's double check. Self-guided adventure. My buddy Zach leading the way, he's from Colorado. They were about to get a foot of snow, so he thought it'd be a good idea to come out to the desert, get a week of riding in. He's got a van as well, and we're staying out at the Circus Circus RV Park, right on the Las Vegas Strip. It's actually pretty decent. 60 bucks a night is a little much, but to have a toilet, it's worth it. And we can walk right into the casino and lose our money. Oh, first cactus hit. <laughs> Joshua tree to the hand. Wild burrow poop, maybe. Ooh. Damn! <laughs> oh. Should have had my gloves on. Oh. Frame slider. Yeah, I sliced myself. <laughs> Giant chunk out of the frame too. Really? Yeah, this is nasty out here. Okay, I'm awake. The blue trail. You just have to remember everything in the desert is trying to kill you at all times. The rocks, the plants, the temperature. <laughs> yeah, add one to the list. Hero dirt. <laughs> oh, we missed it, but that's okay. I think we'll get back there. No, keep going. This is okay. We could double check. Cause so I see, yeah, some up, up top, down low. All right. Yeah. I think I see tires, right? Yeah. Obviously. Whoa. Up to the left, I think. Yeah. <laughs> Duh. <We're fine>. <laughs> <laughs> oh. No way. <laughs> <laughs> and then just like what pokes out because I think the trail should be going to the left nothing uh, oh there it is I see it okay I have no clue it's like literally another yeah shelf like higher above my head yeah a lot of burrow poop yeah we got to get up and over this thing I think uh yeah, I think it's that wall. Obviously. Yep, there's the rocks right there that are trying to show us the way. Ha! Ignored them. Back on it. Whoa. Pain and pleasure. Yeah, we're planning on hitting Bone Shaker, Bomb Voyage for our next ride, but I, I think I did one of those years and years ago. It's just been so long. Yeah. I've got a video on my channel, Cowboy Trails, seven plus years ago. Time flies. 
down. Cool. We've got just a little more climbing to go, and before we make it to the top, I wanna to tell you about the fine sponsor of today's video, the best electrolyte drink mix on the planet, Element. If you get yourself into some big time mountain bike adventures, sweating buckets, cramping, getting headaches, Element is probably the solution for you. It was definitely the solution for me. I tried my best to stay hydrated. I tried so many different types of electrolyte drinks and mixes. All of them had something weird with them. Too much sugar, made me jittery, messed with my stomach. Element is none of that. Element is zero sugar, stevia sweetened, fantastic tasting, and extra salty. The Element Thesis is out with sugar and in with salt. They believe that most people, and especially active, health-conscious people, need more salt in their diet, not less, to feel great and perform their best. I have been all in on Element for a full year now, a full year of really tough rides, sweating my buns off, without cramps, without headaches. The only time I get cramps or headaches is when I forget the element at home and I don't do a good job of hydrating. This stuff is not for everybody, but it is definitely for me. You can find out if it's for you by going to my link, drinkelement.com slash BKXC, put in an order. I think you should try the citrus salt first to dip your toe in and then if you use my link, you'll get a free sample pack in the mail with eight different flavors. Then you can pick which one you like the best and keep that element coming. Once again, my link is D-R-I-N-K-L-M-N-T dot com slash B-K-X-C. Okay, over the top. Wow, cool. Big reveal, okay. This trail was lovingly built by one person with only a bit of help from a few friends that took over 300 hours of work. Okay, so we went out about four and a half miles, and now on the way back, it's about seven miles, so it's gonna be a little more snaky. Wow. <laughs> that was the warning sign. Wow. What the heck? What kind of warning was that? <laughs> Look, oh, if there's you, the line. Look. If you go this, you can ride down that face. Yeah. Down that and then exactly. <laughs> Yikes. Ooh, another one. Okay. Oh, off to the right is like a drop thing. Cool. Clunkers. Oh, that's neat. Nice. Wow. Oh. Got to be in the right gear. Yeah. Perfect. I want to be in my harder gear, but I'm keeping it easy for the next uphill climb. Yeah, nice. <laughs> oh, yeah. How smooth. Nice. It was smooth. <laughs> oh yeah. Man, I'm glad we did this. This is taking really taking a chance for sure just looking at the reviews where some of them didn't really like it. Some did. Seems pretty good to me. 
I'm an awkward rock kind of guy. Oh. Oh yeah. Oh, gap jump. <laughs> Go with the flow. Uh, Whatever you want to do. <laughs> I'm a skipper, but yeah. Gotta have the perfect balance of slow braking without skidding. Once you lock it up, you're gonna be sliding. Oh, uh, <laughs> that was nasty good. <sighs> Yeah. Desert flow momentum. Woo! <laughs> you can't trust it. <laughs> wow. Oh! Wow. Uh. Oh! Man, nicely navigated. Oh, with moly. I got like tunnel vision right now. Yeah, no joke. I'm trying to throw the toilet five feet further. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> Woo. Yeah. Oh, it's a I turn. <laughs> Whoa. Nice. Yee. A lot of Moab flavor, but different. <laughs> oh, yeah. Wow. Super cool. <laughs> this way. My rear tire is definitely getting a little worn out, but <laughs> you know what you gotta do? Push it till it breaks. Yeah. Whoa. Ooh. Tech nasty. Ooh. Whoa, ho, ho. almost slid out the front wheel. Yikes. Respect it. Yeah, this is a pretty good surprise. I say it every single video, but it's just really the best thing ever to look at a thing on trail forks and be like, okay, let's try it out. And sometimes there's no reviews, no photos, no comments, and it turns into something amazing. Oh, sharp edges. This had a little more data of people liking it, people hating it, and me loving it. Oh, 
sledgehammer. How are these bikes able to handle it? Oh, this is so cool. <laughs> Good job. Riding blind out here. Oh yeah. Woo -hoo. Oh, too slow. Yeah. Whoa yeah. There we go. Yeah! That was cool. Up gap. <laughs> yeah! Oh. Going. Yeah. <laughs> That's happened a couple times. <laughs> yes. Oh yeah. A oh, nice. Whoa. Whoa. That was nasty. <laughs> Sneaker got us again. <laughs> Hump. Yeah, I'll have my full workout in by the time we finish this. <laughs> Nice. He's a swinger. Woo! Frame breaking rocks. <laughs> well done. Nice. Man. Oh man, yeah. It's awesome to find somebody that's very similar with ability to ride with and he's just a bit better in quite a few things, so it keeps me on my toes. Oh. oh god <laughs> it goes wow <laughs> jeez going down the cliff edge oh. <laughs> a lot of hip angling We'll see how the finish goes. Yeah, it's so important to have that that good finish. So true. If it just peters out right now, it's like, oh, so you got to kind of end with a bang. Yeah. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> Some rocking turns. Yeah, it's nice to be out on the road again. Get another good road trip in. Do some work at Everstoke. I actually just did a trail work day out at the Crockett Hills. And Trail 1 Components, I donated on behalf of Trail 1 Components $4,000 from the proceeds of the Crockett handlebar aluminum and carbon. That was amazing. It's just so cool to have Trail 1 be rolling and having these products named after awesome trail systems, 
giving back to those trail systems. That's what it's all about. I think we did a thousand bucks last year. At 4,000 this year is just amazing. They're gonna be able to buy some trail tools and put it to use. Get that place rocking and rolling. Good old Crockett Hills. Now it's for the Bicycle Trails Council of the East Bay. Oh, sand pit, flow it. Oh, Whew. to the beach. Oh yeah, yep, here's the split. We're back on flow job. Oh. <laughs> All right. We had the trail to ourselves. Great start. Yeah. That was great, man. Yeah, that was super cool. That was a great way to start this trip. What a fantastic surprise. 12 miles, two hours tons of tough tech on the way up and the way down more on the way down but that one climb at the beginning did get me on the way up and crack the frame and slice my hand and stuff well didn't crack the frame it it hurt the paint on the frame so just superficial back at the circus circus rv park the sun is going down we had a really good dinner over at silver lake ramen there is a massive contingent of Asian restaurants. My favorite, I love Chinese, I love Korean, I love them all, Japanese, anything you can think of, they have them over there. It's like a hundred different Asian restaurants, it's insane. So I had to pick one and Silver Lake Ramen was the winner, very good. Tomorrow, we might go treat ourselves to a big buffet. Looking forward to that. All right, so that was the warm up. We've got a few more to come. We've got ideas, we've got plans. We'll see if we can make it happen. Do me a favor, go write something new and maybe I'll see you on the trail.